हेलो किड्स होप ऑल ऑफ यू आर गुड टुडे योर मदर टीचर टॉपिक इज साउंड पार्ट टू सो लेट्स टॉक अबाउट इट साउंड इज अ टाइप ऑफ एनर्जी मेड बाय वाइब्रेशन व्हेन एन ऑब्जेक्ट वाइब्रेट्स इट कॉज मूवमेंट इन सराउंडिंग एयर मॉलिक्यूल्स दिस मॉलिक्यूल्स बम्प इन द मॉलिक्यूल्स क्लोज टू दैम कॉजिंग दैम टू वाइब्रेट एज वेल दिस मेक्स द बम्प इन मोर नियर बाय द मॉलिक्यूल्स Sounds is created when the something vibrates and sends waves of energy vibration into our air. The vibration travels through the air or another medium solid liquid or gas to near ear. The stronger vibration, the louder the sound. Sounds are fainter the further you get from the sound source. Sound propagation Sound is sequence of waves of the pressure which propagate through the compressible media such as air and water. Sound can propagate through the solid as well, but there are are additional mode of propagation. During their propagation, waves can be reflected, refracted and attend fluctuated by the medium. The traveling of sound is called propagation of sound. Sound cannot propagate in the absence of medium. The place where there is no air and or air is removed is called vacuum. Sound does not propagate travel through the vacuum. Sound loudness. Sound intensity also known as the acoustic intensity is defined as the power of carried by the sound waves per unit area in direction. perpendicular to the area the si unit of intensity which includes sound intensity is the watt per square meter the loudness of sound is the phenomena of a sound depending on the amplitude of the sound wave if the amplitude would of the sound wave is large then the sound is said to be loud the loudness of sound is directly proportional to the square of amplitude of vibration and it is expressed in decibel the shape of outer part of the ear is like a funnel when the sound enter it it travels down canal at the end of the which where is a thin stretches membrane is called eardrum it is perform an important function to understand the eardrum does let us build a tin can model of eardrum oscillation is the repetitive variation typical in times of some measure about the central value or between two or more different states the term vibration is precisely used to describe mechanical oscillations familiar or example of oscillation includes a swinging pendulum and alternating current so let's talk about facts about the sound part 2 number 1 there are many different type of energy of all these types sound energy produces the lowest amount of energy number 2 Since sound energy produces just limit amount of energy it cannot be used to generate electricity. Number 3 sound waves lose energy as they move through a medium. So kids tell me what is oscillation? Please write in a comment section. Hope you all kids are able to learn and recognize about the a sound part 2. If you like my video please like it share it and subscribe my channel also press bell icon thank you for watching thank you for supporting